Okay, I just wanted to show my next little project I made here with the uh, Arduino and MATLAB interface. I wanted to play around with the um, GUI creation within MATLAB and then I ended up um, deciding to try out a seven segment LED which I'd never messed with before and ended up with some oddball program that really serves no purpose but it, I don't know, I thought it was kind of neat. Basically what it does, I have a servo here. Um, it's a continuous servo. It um, basically runs in one direction or the other depending on the signal you send it. And uh, here's my seven segment LED and that's all wired through my solderless breadboard here while going up to my Arduino and um, the server is powered by an external servo is powered by an external uh, power source and so that's the the hardware setup and then let's see I'll go ahead and run this just to kind of show you and oh, there it is you can see it's connecting to the Arduino down here Okay, so here's the interface that is working. Um, you can change what direction you want it to run in. It's either clockwise, off, counterclockwise. Um, you can change how long you want it to run for. Now, as I'm changing those on the slider, you can see the uh, seven digit LED working too. Let's see if I can scoot this so you can show it all in one shot here. Oh, anyway. So then what happens if you hit start? Oops, gotta have a direction to choose. The servo will run until the timer goes and at the same time that the little display counts down depending on what time you have it set at. I can turn it up to nine. And then if you turn this slider all the way up, it goes into continuous mode, which is indicated by the C there. And then you can start it off. And then by clicking the buttons clockwise, counterclockwise, or off, you can change which way the servo moves. And then while it's in continuous mode, um, you can just kick the timer back down, and then it will it will jump into a time counter and stop. So anyway, that's um, my next uh, little project I was working with. It doesn't really serve any function other than teaching me how to do all this. So thanks for watching.